So I hear Lara is finally coming back. Let's discuss about that. So I have been interested in Tomb Raider since I was, well, a kid. Watching my dad play the games, the games got passed on to me eventually, and I finally unlocked a new type of game genre I was very interested in. Till this day, I have been playing the classics, and now, finally, a remaster version has been announced. Tomb Raider has gone through a lot of changes in the past, and while some concepts and ideas have been changed, I still stuck to the games, trying out the many different ways of Crystal Dynamics changed up Lara. I noticed this sudden change in Angel of Darkness, by the way, but we are not discussing about that. Granted, I have played the PS3 games as well, and they really hold up to what Tomb Raider stands for. Even if it was a bit more cinematic, the game still felt genuinely like a Tomb Raider game. I have played some good, some bad, and some interesting versions of Tomb Raider, and yet while some don't feel like a Tomb Raider game, I still enjoyed them nonetheless. Now a remaster is out of the first three games, and I honestly just don't know how to feel about it. Am I hyped? Yes, I really am, but I'm skeptical mostly because from what I have seen from the trailer, there is a lot that needs to be tweaked, freshened up, and texturized more. But I am very keen to know what Croft's Manor is going to look like, since they did not show that at all in the trailer. We only get to see a few sneak peeks of Tomb Raider 1, 2, and 3. The enemies still look a little blocky, but I honestly like how they kept it to feel very classical, but with a fresh look to it. I also noticed that they added new textures and features as well, like the mummy dogs actually have teeth now, and there's a lot more detail of hieroglyphs in Egypt. That dinosaur model in Peru though, I really hope they change it up, cause it looks a little unfinished. Either way, looking forward to finding those dinos. Also, the tomb of the dragon emperor is looking very detailed and spooky, so very pleased to see they are keeping that creep factor of that place. Because if anyone remembers that sound, the ambience of that place gives me goosebumps. <sighs> I can't stop fussing over what Maria Doria is going to look like, which is a chapter I flip in love because underwater levels are my absolute favorite. Which is another thing I did notice. Water textures have not been exactly finished up yet, so I'm wondering what most levels that have water are going to look like. Because there are a lot of levels that have rivers, lakes, and underwater parts in them. Not looking forward to those creepy scuba divers coming after Lara again, because those sounds always made me jump when they showed up, because wow, were those sounds loud. Anyway, will I be playing the remaster when it comes out? Yes, I probably will. However, I will have to hold off buying it instantly when it comes out, because if there are any bugs, I'd rather they get those fixed before I play the game. Granted, I know some people will probably get the game, even if it is bugged to try it out, but kudos to you, I'm gonna wait until it's less buggy. So thank you Crystal Dynamics for making this such a possibility and listening to your fan base. And I look forward to playing the new look of the classics. And I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!